Good afternoon, everybody. Thanks for coming to my channel. My name is one of the guys vlogs. If you're new to the channel, like, subscribe, get on post notifications, and comment down below and let me know what you think about this video. Today we're going to talk about Comic Con. <laughs> Believe it or not. <laughs> Comic Con takes place from July the 21st to the 24th this year. Comic Con is celebration annually following the date given by the responsible bodies in July. This makes it a great four day summer extravaganza. In 2021, the event was held virtually. Comic Con are held all over, but the main event that people think of is the San Diego Comic Con. Comic, Comic Con. The most well known one of its kind. One of a kind up in there, boo! but also has other related pop culture entertainment forms such as gaming, movies, and TV shows. TV shows, I'm sorry. It's surprisingly, the San Diego Comic Con is a non-profit event. The history of Comic Con. Comic books have played a very important role in the development of movie, books, culture, and arts as we see them today. And at an inter inter in I N T E G R A L and yet distinct district part of the pop arts. Comic books are repeat with gripping bright pictures and colors and action. They are superheroes, villains, funny characters, and generally great stories that are brought to life all through the pages of a comic book. Hmm, I thought that's what it was. These books shape and predict the initial journey into the realm of superheroes and action characters. Many of the movies we watch today, including Spider-Man, Batman, and several others, all started in comic books. And that's facts. That's facts, though. Without the comic book, there wouldn't be no Batman, Superman, Spider-Man, and all that. Comic conventions stayed, started in San Diego in 1970 with a group of comic book lovers. It In the beginning, it was called the Golden State Comic Convention. Comic book convention. It later changed to the San Diego Comic Book Convention. The event was created out of the desire of the funding members to meet, socialize, discuss, and enjoy comic books, which they love with like-minded individuals. Hmm. That's what I'm talking about. Over the years, the increased Patreon, Patreons, P-A-T-R-O-N-A-G-E, and attendants have made the event a worldwide holiday. Almost every state in the U.S. now has a has and observe its own comic convention, which turn out fun, packed, and filled with capacity. Every who don't love a superhero? That's what I want to know. I love superheroes. You got me messed up. Okay. Comic Con, Comic Con, not only enjoys comic books and characters, but encompasses the spectrum of pop culture, animation, fantasy, horror, video games, and more. Over 100,000 people flock to the San Diego Convention Center every year to enjoy the event and partake in the fun field festivities in the past few years. Records are broken and recorded in the Guinness Book of World's Record of 130,000 people attending. Whew. God, Timeline. The first comic. Rodolf. A Swedish artist developed the first comic book titled The Adventures of Ob Obedia Old Book. Old Book. Kind of thing. Anyway, 1930, superhero comic. Superhero and Batman comic books are created, giving rise 
to other superhero comics. Yeah, they was the first one that I know of. 1950 Comic Con. Comic Con is stated, it, it started by Dorf and Ken, Richard and Mike. Can't pronounce the last name, so I didn't think. Summer 2003 summer event. This marks the beginning of the Comic Con celebration in July every year. Boy, I like to go to one of those things, the costumes and stuff. That'll be fun. Comic Con, Comic, Comic Con activities. Number one, attended. The best way to celebrate Comic Con, Comic Convention is to attend with the thousands of people there and based in the energy of the day, of the event, various performances and exhibits make the day fulfill fulfilling and you might be lucky enough to see and meet the superstars who act in the superhero roles. I love to meet that baby. Yes sir. <laughs> okay. Number two, get a comic book. Can't attend the event? No problem. Get yourself some comic books and read them. Have great fun with the world of superheroes and villains. Number three, organize your own Comic Con. If you're unable to attend the Comic Con, Comic Con in San Diego, you can get your friends who are lovers of comics and organize your own very own convention. Invite as many people as possible. My in my house looking like crazy. Five fun facts about comics that will blow your mind. Boom! The first hero, number one, the first hero, the first comic book hero was Phantom, created by Lee Falk in 1936. Okay, it was the Phantom, okay. Number two, the most expensive comic book, a 1962 copy of the comic book Amazing Fantasy, was sold for $3.6 million at an art at an auction. Number three, the largest comic book market. J- Japanese comics called manga is the largest comic book market in the world. With over 2 billion mega ma- magna sold every year. Number four, the golden age of comic book. The first Superman comic book in 1938 ushered in a new age of comic books and superheroes in the world. And number five. The most beloved superhero. According to research, Spider-Man is the most loved superhero in the world. Not the state. In the world. Okay. Why we love Comic-Con. A. It is an opportunity to enjoy art. Comic books are art. Rooted in, in pop culture. Comic books and can't common and immersive. And the convention itself it is celebrated of the art. B. It's fun. Meeting hundreds of people, meeting hundreds, meeting hundreds of thousands of people who love the same thing as you is a great feeling. You get to see other people enjoy themselves and also get to enjoy yourselves too. C. Celebrate our superheroes. There is another opportunity. No, oh, this is another opportunity to celebrate the superheroes that made our childhood fun. It is time to celebrate and appreciate these superheroes from Batman, Spider-Man, Robin, and even the newer ones and their creators. <sighs> that was fun feel. A lot of hard work, but I still made it through, thank God. So if you're new to the channel, like, subscribe, click on post notifications so you never miss a video. Comment down below. Let me know what you think about this video. If it is your will, it say it'll be done. Remember, you're too blessed to be stressed. Love and happiness at all times. Hug somebody, tell me you love them. And I can't stress it enough. I ain't said in the last few videos, but pick up the phone and call somebody and do a random act of kindness. You never know what you may do to that person. You might make that person's day. And in the long run, God going to bless you later on down the road. So do that for me, okay? Until next time, peace. <laughs>